people see the landmark decision out of Oklahoma as a turning point in the nation's fight against opioids. A judge now ordering drug maker Johnson & Johnson to pay more than half a billion dollars for its role in the crisis there. Chris Welch introduces us to an ER doctor who hopes her program, combined with court battles against drug companies, will help. Nationally, this is a huge epidemic. It's estimated that over 130 people die every single day from an opioid overdose. And even for those who recognize they may have a problem, it can take months to get help and a prescription for the medication they might need. And this is where we'll do our initial assessment and monitoring. Dr. Ashley Curry is an emergency psychiatrist and part of the team of doctors at Denver Health's Treatment On Demand program. We recognize that there was really a gap in um, when people were ready to start treatment and how quickly they could access that treatment. So we are trying to fill that gap. Their solution, same day treatment. Day or night, 24 seven, our emergency room is open and people can come in and start on medication assisted treatment. Over 300 patients so far have used the hospital's emergency department for treatment and about 70% of those have continued with clinic follow-ups. Dr. Curry hopes that yesterday's verdict against drug maker Johnson & Johnson means the tide might finally be turning. That verdict really helps to represent like the collective consciousness about how problematic opioid use disorder has become for our country. Recognizing that this is a major problem, it's a public health crisis. Reporting in Denver, I'm Chris Welch.